up next, we have Bob Williams with Catlin, and he is the president of the board of directors of the Community Arts Council of Greater Victoria, and he's here to talk about some of the recent changes that are taking place at the Community Arts Council of Greater Victoria. So go ahead, Catlin. Thanks, Bob, for being here. Thank you. Hi, Bob. Thanks for joining us at Victoria Arts Live. Oh, it's a very great opportunity. I'm excited. Oh, that's great. So the Community Arts Council, uh, heard a lot of talk about it, but for those people who don't know uh, what it does or some of the services it provides, can you talk a bit about um, some of the opportunities for artists and some of the uh, programming that you've done? Yeah, so the, the Community Arts Council was established in uh, 1966, and it has programs related to visual arts, media arts, literary arts, uh, dance and music. Uh, the, the fundamental purpose of the, the Community Arts Council was to connect artists, uh, to encourage arts in the community, and to uh, uh, encourage our, our political leaders to understand how important the arts are. That's great. And some, what are some of the activities that the uh, CAC undertakes uh, during a year? Oh, during a typical year, then uh, uh, we've, uh, we've been operating an art gallery for a number of years. So there'd be uh, bi-weekly shows uh, at our uh, gallery. In addition, then uh, we, we were involved in a, a, a choir event recently at, uh, as part of the Victoria Music Festival. And I'm also pleased to say we're, we're part of this uh, event. Great, great. And I know that the Look Show has been very popular and has been going on for a while. Um, and uh, yeah, what's, what are the opportunities there for an artist? How does, how does the Look Show work? So the, the Look Show is open to, uh, to any artist who, who cares to participate, and uh, we typically have it around February. Uh, part of the, uh, the success of the Look Show has been the fact that uh, the Bay Centre has provided us with space for the last number of years. So they donate the space, we put out the word to all the artists in, uh, in town, and uh, people pay a, a modest entry fee. Uh, there's some prizes involved. So this year we had uh, about uh, uh, 650 works of art and uh, over lot. 300 artists participating. That's great. That's that's an awful lot of yes, artwork. It is to be seen. And is this this is an ongoing? It's uh, a it's, hopefully? it's an annual event. And uh, this year, then uh, we, do, we in talking to the bay, then we decided why don't we mix it up a bit? And that, so we put the question to them: What if we did this event more than once a year? And they were very amenable to that. So. We're looking at that as a, as a possible future activity. That's great. I know that the CAC has undergone some fairly significant changes recently, including uh, an exciting new partnership. Can you talk a bit about that? Absolutely, yes. Uh, uh, and, and we had been quiet for quite some time as we were working out the details of this. Uh, so we have left the uh, traditional gallery we've been in downtown in uh, Sussex Place at, at Fort and Douglas. Uh, we've left that venue. Uh, we've gone up and we've uh, made a partnership with the District of Saanich. So we're going to be a founding partner in the, uh, the Arts Centre at Cedar Hill. So our office will be there and uh, uh, we're in the middle of negotiations right now with the District of Saanich around how to help them with their arts programs. They're very interested in making connections with the communities. And uh, uh, we're pretty excited to have a, a, a partner like that. Great, yeah, that's great. So it sounds like um, you're still going to have a gallery space and stuff available and an office. And yes, there, there's, there's uh, an office there, there is gallery space. Uh, the, the addition they're putting onto the rec center uh, is approximately 7,000 square feet. So there's, uh, there's rooms for uh, uh, music and performance. Uh, there's space for, for painting, for uh, uh, clay arts, as, as well as a gallery. Great, that all sounds very exciting, and uh, we'll look forward to uh, hearing more about the CAC in the future and some of its future programming. Yes, we will. Thank like you very much. Do. Thank you.